Hey there, you are listening to Drummer Daily, the podcast, the world's first and only, I think, daily podcast for drummers. My name is Daniel, I'm your host, and in case you've never listened to this podcast before, this is how every podcast is. No frills, no music, no intro, just me talking. Why is that? It's because I do it every day, and if I had to do all that other stuff, I would never get around to doing the podcast, and I want to do it daily for you guys. So... That's why you don't hear any crazy production on this. Uh, Speaking of crazy production, um, and I've heard from a few of you guys that you'd like to hear more practical tips for drumming, and I hear you loud and clear, so uh, tomorrow I promise you I will have a very practical uh, tip for playing drums with a click track, playing in a studio, playing live, uh, something that will make uh, everything you're doing sound a lot cleaner and uh, uh, have a little more groove to it. Uh, But today, because it's Monday, Um, When I'm recording this, you might get this on Tuesday morning, but because it's Monday when I'm recording this, I wanted to talk to you about something that maybe will motivate you for the week. And that is this. I have been working on this thing called Boom Click Boot Camp for a while. And today got to the point where I had to, uh, it's it's a 14 day boot camp and each day um, has three or four little exercises that each are about, you know, four or five minutes long. And so each of those, uh, each of those exercises needs uh, a click track, but it's not just a regular click track. It's going to be one that's programmed. So it uh, beats drop in and out, uh, accents change, uh, the click goes away completely for a few bars to kind of make it more of a game where you can kind of hear how well you're keeping up and how well you're holding the beat down. Um, and so it kind of makes things a little more fun than just playing along and practicing with a click track, playing the same old thing over and over again. Anyway, I had to go, uh, I have to program all these click tracks and uh, I didn't really do the math on the front end, but I realized that 14 days of, uh, of, of exercises uh, in each of those days has between three and five exercises, which meant that I had to program unique click tracks for each of those three or five exercises each day. So you do the math on that and the way it worked out for me is I had 53 original click tracks that I had to program and so I was doing that today and uh, you know there's not many things like what I'm doing with this with this boot camp thing and I always was like man why has no one done this before and I think I realized today why no one has done this before it's because it's a lot of work and that's just making this thing not not all the work that goes into actually making sure people know about it and can participate and all the technical stuff it's a lot of work and I think that's kind of the same thing that happens uh, with guys who are really are the top level of drummers in the world. Uh, they are there, they're definitely, everyone who's kind of a professional drummer or, you know, gets a lot of gigs, they're definitely talented and, uh, you know, there's some God-given ability there that I don't want to take away from. Uh, but there's a lot of really talented guys who are still just playing in their basement and wish they could get a gig. Um, and I know that a lot of people uh, in drumming aren't willing to do the work. And I don't mean... Uh, learning some crazy heavy metal song with double kick with all these crazy drum fills or watching some YouTube video where you, you know, you learn some new lick that you can throw in to impress all your friends. I'm talking about real work. I'm talking about things like I used to do when I was a kid where I would sit and I would play the same drum pattern with no drum fills, just, you know, a a normal steady beat for 10 minutes or 15 minutes or 20 minutes straight. I'm sure it drove my parents and my neighbors crazy, but doing work where you play the same thing that's almost boring and listening to every nuance of what's coming out of your hands and your feet, uh, that's hard work. It's because people think of hard work with drumming. They think of playing all these crazy awesome things and sweating in a storage unit because they, you know, that's where they can practice, playing all these amazing drum fills and crazy stuff. Uh, But the hard work that it takes to be a professional drummer for most situations, and that means studio and getting hired to play gigs live, the hard work that that requires is paying attention to detail and actually being willing to find interest in the boring stuff of playing drums, all the, the nuance and the intricacies of every little hit and playing every, every single hit on the drums with attention, intentionality and really um, focusing on, on what's coming out. Uh, you can tell I get a little fired up about this. but. So I guess this kind of is some practical application too. Do the work, but make sure you're doing the hard work that no one else is willing to do. Everyone else is willing to play crazy stuff and learn really, you know, really impressive drum licks. But there's very few people who are willing 
to put the time and effort into the boring, hard, laborious stuff that it really takes to become a professional drummer. So if you want to be a pro, or if you're trying to get a pro, uh, become a pro, or trying to get some gigs, um, or if you already are a pro and um, you know you want to keep working at it, uh, focus on the little things. That's what makes the difference between the really successful studio and live drummers and the guys who just kind of float around and uh, play every once in a while. Um, so I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Like I said, I promise that we'll have some practical application for you tomorrow. Oh, and also, if you're listening to this pretty uh, uh, pretty recently, like in real time. Um, the beta sign up for Boom Click Bootcamp is going away on August 15th. Um, so as I'm recording this, that's less than a week away. Um, so if you have any interest at all in the beta program uh, and getting free access to this bootcamp, you should go over and sign up for that uh, as quickly as possible at danielhadaway.com slash beta. Um, and uh, yeah, get in there while you can. Anyway, thanks guys for listening to this. I appreciate it. I've already been blown away at how many people have been downloading this after just one week of broadcasting. Uh, so I'm really excited to keep doing this for you guys. Um, send me an email if you have any questions or uh, anything like that. I read every email that I receive and I reply to every email that I receive. Uh, just send me an email at daniel at danielhadaway.com. All right, guys. Talk to you tomorrow. Bye.